Hi, in this video I'm going to demonstrate on uh, using of the tool for reconciliation purpose or to track the changes. Uh, for this example, uh, I have created uh, sample data here. This is the ledger data that I have in my ledger and this is the bank statement that I received. I just wanted to find out whether these two are the same or is there any differences between them. For this reason, I'll have to select the primary column. In this case, the primary column is the account number. For each account number, I need to track what are the different changes there. And then, it, uh, I just wanted to sort the, by the transaction date in the ascending order so that I can see the data uh, next to each other for the ledger as well as the statement. I can choose what is the color I need to highlight the changes. I choose uh, green here and click on the process okay now <coughs> sorry it has completed the processing there now I can see the differences here um, for the same account number this is the difference and here in the ledger okay we can ignore this because this is the source we have created what is the source ledger and the statement here so this is one change that we can see for this account there is a different mismatch between the amount and in this particular account of 94 we can see this amount as well as the transaction type has a difference similarly for the 96 now this is one example how fast we can use this powerful tool to reduce your time it can process hundreds and thousands of records in fraction of time and another example is in hundreds and thousands of records we may not be finding there may be one um, one trans one transaction missing either in ledger or in the bank statement for that reason i am deleting this record i am resetting it and then running it again ah, okay this is the code okay it identifies which is the record it does not have the statement in this case it has a ledger value but there is no bank statement value there uh, for another example let's delete the ledger value so I'm just deleting this ledger value and then I'm deleting this enter column so that I'll reset it I am running it again. This is uh, these are the two rows. It identifies as a single record. It does not have another account statement. Okay, this is the details, and uh, uh, we can use uh, a different values so if I wanted to use the results to be displayed in a new workbook instead of here. I can use this option to click here. Uh, it can create results in a new sheet. This is a new workbook. You can see this book three, and uh, uh, it creates. This is the, my initial value, and this is the book three. It has created me another one. You can save it. This file in different values. That's all for this demonstration. If you have any queries, you can please write to me. I'll be providing below this video where to write. Okay. Thank you. Have a nice day.